reflecting on one's moral compass, translating thought to action, transforming success to significance, pondering on one's legacy. Kamal Nayan Bajaj Fellowship seeks to foster the next generation of young values-based leaders with a vision to build a community of leaders who will be the custodians of a good society through their thoughts, deeds and voices. The fellowship provides young leaders with an opportunity to understand their own leadership styles, challenges and encourage them to engage more vigorously to address the challenges of their community and country. Well, the relevance of a values-based leadership program is really to be able to look at uh, the various values that you, uh, which are considered really important for you when you have to take decisions on anything. Here, I met a group of uh, young people who had ideas, who had a lot of optimism in life, and that was the best thing I found. One of the primary initiatives in the realm of leadership development under Ananta Aspen Center, it is a unique fellowship which has been running successfully since 2006. It is an experience that you are initiating in your life and it will continue for the rest of your life. I have to say two years after the, uh, the experience of the fellowship, it was a life-changing experience. Why? One, I, the frames of reference that I had about leadership changed completely. Uh, I only had uh, frames of references of corporate or other kinds of leaders that I had come across. But sitting around the table for the, uh, for the two years around leaders from different parts and walks of life, including those that don't have corporate objectives, really, really uh, helped me understand what inspires leaders and what makes them to do stuff. Kamal Nayan Bajaj Fellowship, formerly known as the India Leadership Initiative, ILI, is a part of the growing worldwide community of entrepreneurial leaders, Aspen Global Leadership Network. This is like a, a sustainable steroid which has no side effects. Um, you float into wanting to just do more and more and the more and more becomes less and less about yourself. The fellowship enabled an interaction with people from other uh, parts of society, the corporate sector, entrepreneurs, uh, government officials, politicians, media, and apart from my own, uh, you know, fellows in the social sector. So that engagement across all those two years gave me a lot of food for thought and ideas. The fellowship, I would say, is uh, a journey of uh, self-discovery. Uh, it's more about uh, it's more about uh, listening to yourself, your inner voice, seeing where you stand. Um, on profound issues of society, of nation, of government. I use this word carefully, it's called companionship. Mm -hmm. I got this board of trustees mm -hmm. who I can trust implicitly, who will never compete with me, mm -hmm. who will never out to go ahead and get me fired. Comprising of over 2,300 fellows from over 50 countries, it's a significant platform for not only networking and knowledge sharing, but also deep bonding and lifelong friendships within the circle of trust. In Aspen, everything opened up. I mean, I, I met people who have come with fantastic solutions. I've met people who have actually come out of their comfort zone and far away from their comfort zone. They've taken risks, they've done things, and they're normal people. I mean, they've had their fears, they've had their doubts, and yet they have just done it. I think this is just so amazing that fellows can come together, work with each other, even after the batch experience and the graduation is over. What the fellowship did to me uh, has been a miracle. It gave me access to uh, uh, some of the best minds and hearts in the country and across the world uh, that not only uh, helped me with uh, insights, but also left me feeling a lot more secure about my own dreams. Focusing on young entrepreneurial leaders between the ages of 35 to 45, the fellowship is designed to help leaders move from success to significance and from thought to action. Fellowship has really done for us is really change the way we think and I think if you change the way you think then everything else changes your action your life your life's choices how you do what you do at work what you do in your personal life the values you live by but I think it all goes back to that single point about the mind you know it's the thought and those seeds that we planted through this whole fellowship in our minds it's not just about thoughts it's about action and uh, in fact I like process I love us to become action leaders rather than thought leaders. Kind of uh, uh, network of 
real uh, believers and uh, friends at this stage in life that you make is just amazing and uh, that co completely gives you a different level of motivation and a different uh, level of connect altogether just you know a bouncing board of uh, you know like, uh, really trust for the people who you can uh, bounce of anything which which kind of uh, uh, makes life uh, so much simpler in in various ways when i uh, did look i did confront choices or opportunities um, i i gave myself a broader perspective and uh, i believe that was much richer as a result of that in, in the dialogue that we had during the whole process, the engagement, not just within our, our sector in our country itself, but also the global aspect, has indeed get me to understand the different kind of leadership, the different kind of uh, situation that can be dealt, and what exactly as leaders we would need to focus. Looking more into the ethical values, looking more into our conviction and our compassion towards leadership. What I took away from the Aspen program are three key things. One is how do you handle challenges of life through the content we studied in. Two, everybody has challenges in life and that's what you learn from your contemporary and peers at, uh, in the leadership program. And three, the importance of leadership and success in life. Uh, it is uh, what you learn and take away from this program provides you the key ingredients in terms of leading uh, and succeeding in life. The specifically designed curriculum comprises four seminars and leadership development activities, Socratic dialogue and reading-based discussion, which challenges the fellows to think about their own moral compass and what constitutes a good society. The ILI program and uh, the association with the Aspen Institute has really given me a whole new set of values and a lot of courage to be able to carry on with difficult social entrepreneurship work in a very remote part of India, the Himalayas. And it has also helped me to bond with an incredible and very, very inspirational group of people from across the world. And I think my entire perspective has changed a lot after um, being part of the ILI particularly the inaugural class because at that time everything was completely new and we didn't really know what we were getting in for but it's been a life-changing experience and um, it has really helped me set my moral compass on a true path and has changed my life. This was more of an internal education. It was, it was happening at a subconscious, subatomic yeah. level and uh, there was no teacher. Yeah. If another another thing yeah. that I like taught us that they don't need a teacher yeah. in the kingdom of elders. Yes. You need moderators, moderators. and uh, the moderators who who spoke the least, but who conveyed uh, most the most. <laughs> and uh, that's yeah. another beautiful facet. Of I think it came at a very appropriate time because the principles that you live by and succeed in corporate world are very different when you enter public life. And I think uh, it gave a perfect segue. Aspen was a perfect segue from transition, uh, transitioning from uh, a corporate world to a public life and actually it humanized you. So it helped me to look further inwards and outward and scalability which I would have never imagined without the fellowship program. I think what I have really taken away is inspiration, uh, inspiration from a very strange source, uh, inspiration to do something much much more than what I thought I was capable of doing. So very interesting you know companionship, inspiration, I mean I am truly inspired and I am truly inspired each time I go to Aspen. I walk away feeling like I can take on the world. One of the biggest takeaway from the programs is to have the buddies that you make in the Aspen program and the fact that you can share some of your loveliest moments, your greatest worries and to have them guide you and to help you out. And I think it has also helped me try and understand myself and also understand the world a little better. Steering aspirants on a journey of leadership and opening their minds to new learning experiences. The fellowship has been leading them on a personal journey of reflection, insight and action. Kamal Nayan Bajaj Fellowship, empowering the next generation leaders.